Hi guys, it's T-Bone Pearson here. I just got some uh, packages from UPS and uh, I just started to open them and I thought, hey, maybe you know you guys would want to see it too because you know I know you guys are filmmakers as well. Uh, so let's have a look. All right, so in this box, uh, well actually, this is my Lily Put field monitor down there. I got those in the same box. Uh, that's like a battery and the battery charger right there. And we'll have a look at this in a second. Uh, this box, uh, I ordered some Spell Fury DVDs because we're going to a gaming convention in about two weeks. Uh, so there it is there. It's season one with like behind the scenes footage and commentary. So we've got 15 uh, copies of Spell Fury season one. All right, and in this box, again, yeah, we've got the battery and the battery charger. Throw that up there. All right, so this is the Lilliput monitor. Um, so what I'm finding is up here on my camera, uh, this is my the Canon XH-A1S. Uh, they've got like a little tiny screen. I'll pull it out for you guys. Uh, Alright, let's switch this around. Come on, pop it there. There we go. So you have this little tiny screen. It's like, you know, two and a half inches. And, uh, you know, when we're shooting Spell Fury, I hook up a big monitor to it. But when I'm shooting sort of in the field or um, out in the woods, a lot of times you can't set up that monitor. So I'm thinking of putting the lily put up here on this hot shoe right there and uh, I'll have a seven inch screen so that's the plan uh, so now the high-end broadcast ones are like about a thousand dollars you know just to start getting into high def so I sort of went with sort of a lower end one but I don't know it might work I did a lot of research let's pop this sucker open it's hard to hold it Get the camera. oh man all right so I may pull out with my teeth or something Okay, uh, or I can just rip it. Hey, give me one second here. We'll just, I'll prop you guys up here for a second. You can look at nothing just for two seconds. Just bear with me. All right, we got the lily put open here. All right, it looks pretty, looks pretty good. Pretty cool. Got these little knobbies there. Uh, yeah, but the proof's going to be in the pudding. Oh, well, okay, I'm going to pull off that little tab there. And, uh, let's see. Okay, this is hard holding... I'm filming this with my my playbook, my BlackBerry playbook. Okay, so we pulled that off. That's really nice. And yeah, so I've got these little. I guess uh, you plug the battery into this, and then into the back of the Lily Put. Uh, maybe that's what that is too. I have to figure all this stuff out. What else did I get? Okay, well, this is the HDMI to uh, mini HDMI, I believe. Although it looks like HDMI to HDMI. No, I think, no, it's mini. Um, so this will plug from the camera into uh, the lily put. Now the only problem with the Canon is that it doesn't have HDMI out. It's just, unfortunately, I don't know why they didn't put it on there. Um, but I'm just going to be using component cables. Uh, so I will be going into those guys right there um, with B and C adapters. So I'll be going component out. Um, I would have liked to go HDMI, but hey, it's not on the camera. So what do you do? All right, so here is the AC adapter uh, for the lily put. Um, and this is some type of mounting device. Oh, and a, and a, uh, a sun hood. So, uh, yeah, so I'm going to upload this now to show you guys. And then hopefully the next video I'm going to have it on top of there and powered up and good to go. I may have to recharge the batteries, uh, but... Yeah, anyways, I just want to show you guys this because I know you guys make videos too. And this thing wasn't too pricey. The Lily Put was, uh, I think it was like $300 uh, and that included shipping. So to the door. So if it, you know, it's, it looks like a pretty big screen. So we'll see how it goes. Anyways, uh, I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.